How can you tell if an animal is happy or sad? In this video, we'll challenge you to work out which is the happy animal and which isn't. Before we explain more, let's play the game. First up, some cows. Which is the happier one? It's the one on the right. The one on the left is panting and shows signs of heat stress. The one on the right is lying down while chewing the cud, a normal behaviour. Of course, many scientists steer away from terms like happy and unhappy, which are a bit human-centric slash unscientific. Let's try another. The pigs don't know whether the bowl at the bottom of the screen contains a chocolate treat or coffee beans, which they really don't like. Which is the optimistic and which is the pessimistic pig? The pessimistic pig is the one on the left. See how it cautiously approaches the bowl in this experiment, whereas the optimistic pig just goes for it. The speed the pig runs towards the bowl indicates whether they interpreted the unknown contents to be positive or negative. Let's play another game, but this time with fish. Can you tell which of these zebrafish is happy and which is unhappy? The one on the top is the happier, healthier individual, which we can see from the way it swims and explores the tank. The bottom fish isn't so active, which is an indication that not all is well. These are examples of how BBSRC funded researchers are using the latest technologies, from animal mounted cameras to cutting edge thermograms and autonomous tracking software, to give us never seen before insights into animals' internal states. The next one is quite tricky. See if you can work out which one is the stress chicken from this thermogram. The colours indicate temperature, white is warmer and blue cooler. The stressed chicken is the one on the left. Look closely at the comb just above the beak and face. The comb is redder and less white, showing that the hen on the left is reducing the flow of warm blood to the surface and towards its organs in case it has to escape. If you found this one hard, don't worry, scientists find it hard too. That's because in general, animals are very adept at hiding their internal state from humans and each other. This is especially true for grazing animals like cows and sheep which hide their health problems and signs of physical weakness not to make themselves a target for predators. Last one. Which are the happy cows and which are the unhappy cows? Actually, both groups are happy here. Although the stampeding cows in the clip above look aggressive, this is a behaviour they display naturally when exploring. And as for the bottom clip, well, who isn't happy when they're eating? This is just a snapshot of the frontiers of animal welfare research underway by BBSRC-funded scientists at universities and institutes up and down the UK. There's a lot more to discover for the benefit of the animals and how we live with them. See the accompanying feature for more on what BBSRC is doing in this field.